This is the national championship game. Today we have number one Miami taking on number two Penn State. Live from Tempe, Arizona, Miami, they are 13 and 0. Penn State, they are 9 and 2. They have the number two ranking in the nation and hope to represent the Big Ten well today. Miami, this is their third national championship appearance in three, excuse me, in four years. They beat Texas A&M 28 to 24 in season three. In season four, they beat Florida 42 to 30. Then there was a break with Tennessee beating Nebraska, and now we're back here. Miami versus Penn State. John Brown, he is their quarterback, the Maxwell Award winner. You saw his numbers there. This man is different. This man is special. Can you do what Samson did and bring home a natty for the Hurricanes? Before that, let's check out the rest of the bowl games. New Orleans Bowl, you had Rice beating Florida Atlantic Champ Sports Bowl. You had NC State putting a beat down on Louisville 50 to 34. Eastern Michigan will lose to UAB in the in the GMAC Bowl, the Posada Bowl. You got Central Michigan falling to Colorado State. ECU will fall to Virginia Tech in a pretty close ball game there. Washington State will beat Utah. Nevada, they would fall to Tulane in the Hawaii Bowl. Florida State will beat the other FSU. Fresno State, 40-21. to Toledo will fall to TCU. Houston, they would fall to Texas Tech in the Independence Bowl. Inside Bowl, Cincinnati got destroyed by Cal. Purdue, they put hands on Oklahoma, winning by seven there. Georgia Tech, they will fall to Pittsburgh. Lafayette will beat down San Jose State in the Houston Bowl. The Emerald Bowl, Maryland beats Air Force. Oregon, they will fall to Nebraska. Western Michigan, excuse me, will beat Southern Miss. UCLA will beat Illinois in the Sun Bowl. The AutoZone Liberty Bowl would see BYU lose to UTEP. Georgia Southern, our boys handle business in the Chick-fil-A Peach Bowl, 24 to 6. And then Florida, they will lose to Michigan State. South Carolina, they would beat Colorado by 4. Notre Dame would fall to Virginia, 43 to 19. Alabama and Michigan, you love to see it. Michigan put hands on the Crimson Tide, 42 to 12. Iowa, they would lose to Washington by winning the Rose Bowl. LSU, Ole Miss, SEC action in Louisiana, and of course, they will get the job done in the Sugar Bowl. Louisiana beats Ole Miss 56 to 30. Texas A&M, they will beat Connecticut, and now we are here. This is the tale of the tape. Miami, they got the best quarterback in the nation, as I mentioned already, in John Brown. Morris, he was 250 yards away from 2,000. Now, for Penn State, Finner was their quarterback for some of the season due to injury. But Graham Robinson, he is healthy. He is their starter. He is not on the same level as John Brown, but maybe, just maybe, he can get things done today. Penn State may have to rely on their defense and a nice rushing attack to stay with the mighty, mighty Hurricanes. That pass going to be caught by Andy Shaw. That's going to be a game of round seven. Seven, eight, and one the ball with Morris and Frederick is there to lay the lumber. Third down and four. Play fake. John Brown throws it. Has the man open. That pass is caught by Richard Cook, who's cooking down that sideline. Touchdown, Miami. And just like that, the Hurricanes are up 7 0. That hit as fast as a hurricane out of nowhere. And we're going to see what Penn State can do for their own 22 yard line. They're going to run the ball. That is going to be John Washington. And John Washington is back to the line of scrimmage. Now they give it to the fullback up the gut. And Gavin Porter, he's going to pick up around four. So third down and six for the 26. Graham Robinson has his pass tipped and then picked. Darren Rhodes. Inside the 10 and draft at the five yard line. The first mistake of the game goes to Penn State. First and goal. That's going to be Lance Landry off of the edge and gets to the quarterback. Second down and goal. They fake the run. John Brown rolls to the left, throws it back across the middle. That pass will be hauled in by Moses. And that's going to set up third down and goal from the fourth. They're going to run the ball. And look at that Penn State defense slamming the door shut. This is a big goal line stand. It's better to be down by 10 than 14. So Penn State back on the field. First down and 10. They're going to run the ball. Washington, and he's going to get gobbled up out there. That's Smith with the stop. Second down and 16. Graham Robinson fires it to the flat. And that pass will be hauled in by Doug Freeman, but he goes nowhere fast. So third down and long. They take a shot deep down. Fielding that pass is well defended. Rhodes gets a hand in there to bat that thing away. They're going to run the ball. 
Morris weaving through traffic and Cedric Morris with a gain of eight to end the first quarter. So second down and two from the 46 to start the second quarter and Lance Landry. He must not have been invited to the cookout because he all kinds of upset taking his frustrations out on John Brown. Third down, Brown steps up in the pocket. He's gonna find Mike Jamison and that pass goes for a first down. Miami's at the 11 yard line. Toss play now, Cedric Morris weaving through traffic, hurling a couple of would-be tacklers. Gets it to the end zone and Miami is up by three scores already and we're still here in the second half, the second quarter, excuse me, of play. So Edgar Davis on the kick return, gets it up to the 21 yard line, split back formation for Penn State. They try to pass the game again and Freeman hauls it in. Perfect pass by Robinson there. Play fake, going back to the airs, Penn State. Robinson lets it fly, caught downfield, gain of 36 by Edgar Davis on his first reception of the contest. Looking downfield, that pass caught by the tight end, Reese. And it's gonna be a gain of nine on that play. Our formation gonna give it to the up back, that's Gavin Porter. The fullback, get your fullbacks involved. First down, Penn State. Find it downfield, Edgar Davis had it, but the hit knocks the football to the grass. Second down and 10. Robinson has that pass broken up. That was big, Daniel Hill. Hit the quarterback on top of smacking the ball to the ground. So third down and 10 now for the 22 yard line. Looking now, field is Robinson. Under some pressure and that pass broken up at the line of scrimmage. And he got hit by the man that broke it up. That's Harrington that said, I want to smack the quarterback too. So Penn State got to set up for a field goal, but they're following on the scoreboard. 17 to three is, a, is the score. Miami on top, passing the ball over the middle is Brown. He's going to find Sam Timbers. Looking now, field that pass gonna be incomplete. Second down in 10, they try to pass in game again. That pass will also be incomplete. So now Miami is looking at a third down and 10. Penn State sends a four man rush. John Brown avoids the rush, throws in the traffic. It's caught by Moses, but shy of the first down. So Penn State, with under a minute, has a chance to maybe drive downfield. But with passes like that, it might be very, very hard to do so. Second down in 10, that pass, another errant throw. Third and 10, 50 seconds on the clock. They're gonna run the ball with Washington, and Washington's gonna pick up a first down. So trust John to get the job done, and he does right there. They go back to the air. That pass caught, that's Freeman, and Doug Freeman has it at the 45-yard line. 30 seconds on the clock. Robinson, rolling left, throws it under duress, and it's caught! What a play! Coming back to the football was Reese, and now they're in enemy territory where that pass will be broken up. A touchdown will be big here, but a field goal will be nice as well. Definitely don't want to turn the ball over. That pass is going to be caught by Matthew. Shy of the first down marker. They're going to settle for a field goal. The kick is up. Kick is good. And that's going to do it for the first half of play. Penn State down by 11. The numbers are fairly even, but that one turnover is the big separation point in this one. That pass caught by Doug Freeman. Wide receiver screen goes nowhere. Rhodes with the takedown. Going to the air again. That pass caught by Reese. That's going to be a gain of around nine. So third down and one. They give it to the fullback. And Matt Huff was having none of it. And now Penn State has to send the ball away. They're going to run the ball. Cedric Morris breaks the tackle. He's loose. Going to fight for every inch. Gets dropped at the 49-yard line. Second leading rusher in the country. They get the ball to him again. And he's going to pick up a gain of five. From the 45. They fake the run. Brown to the air, throws it in that pass behind his receiver. Third down and five, Brown sets his feet, throws it to the flat to Morris, but the pass leads him out of bounds, so Penn State holds. But they take over, they take over from inside their own 10. That pass broken up, nice play there by Wilson. Robinson throws it, and that pass again, not a very good one. He is nine of 19. Third down and 10, the third straight pass play for Penn State, and this one is dropped. Edgar Davis had it. The coverage was pretty tight. You expect your impact player to walk away with that reception. That pass caught, and that is Anthony Moses coming through for his quarterback again. Inside the red zone, Brown fires, and it's going to be intercepted. That's going to be a house call for Jeff Crosby. Touchdown, Penn State, and they're back in the ball game. Just when you thought this thing was going Miami's way from start to finish, 
They have a mix up in the red zone and Penn State's in the end zone and they're down by just four. 17 to 13 is the score to go up the gut. And Morris, he picks up two. They're going to go with the end around. Now they're going to pitch to Morris. Now he's going to look to throw it. That was a lot to do nothing on that play. John Brown has it, throws it. That pass well defended. And Penn State going to get the ball back to start the third quarter. So first down in 10. Robinson fires it. That pass caught by Reese. He loves the big tight end. They're going to run the ball. No, they're going to go with a play fake out of the 13 personnel. They fire to the left side. Caught, but out of bounds. So third and one. They're going to run the ball. And there goes Washington. 20, 10, 5, and caught at the one-yard line. He was a foot away from taking it all the way. But Miami has all kinds of athletes on defense, and that speed proved to be the difference on that play. First thing goal, that pass. Caught and then dropped. And now they're looking at second down and goal from the one. They're going to go to the air again, and another air and throw. Run the ball. Third and goal. They go back to the air, and this time it's going to be caught by Matthews. Touchdown, Penn State. I figure you're one yard away, just run the ball, but they went with three straight pass plays and they finally got the job done. So Marcus Edwards sends this one into the end zone, but Miami's going to bring it out, and that was a mistake as they don't even see the 15 yard line. So Miami would take over from the 13, they're going to run the ball. Morris fighting for every inch, breaking tackles and picking up seven hard fought yards. Under some pressure, and down goes John Brown. John Walker got to him. And now they got to go for a deep pass on third and long, and that is not going to work out. That pass intercepted by Eddie White, and now things look a whole lot different, and they feel different too. Talks by the John Washington and Miami's defense. Know what time it is. They got to get off the field. Second down and eight. Under pressure, and that pass will fall incomplete. Third down and eight. Out of the gun. They fake the draw. They throw it downfield, and that pass is well defended. And Miami's defense answers the call. The kick by Edwards is going to be up, and it is going to be good. So Penn State is up by six. 17 to 23 is now the score. John Brown fakes it, throws it over the middle. That pass is going to be caught. I thought it was going to be intercepted, but that's Cook with another reception there. John Brown on the run. He does throw a pick. This one's going to be over. There is a flag down, and Penn State was off sides. So first and five for Miami. Brown throws it. That pass was also another chance for Penn State to walk away with this one. Wilson drops the interception that time. That pass going to be caught. Frederick with the tackle. It's going to be a first down for Miami. They throw the ball over the middle. They hang on to the catch. But Andy Shaw, he appears to be shaken up. Hopefully it's not too serious. That pass will be broken up at the line of scrimmage. So third down and eight, 51 seconds to go here in the natty. Looking down through this John Brown. John Brown throws it. That pass caught, and Miami is up to the 26-yard line. Move those chains. They throw the ball to the flat. Moore is going to get wrapped up. Gain of four on that one. Second down and six. Penn State sends a blitz, and the blitz got beat. Touchdown, Miami. Walter Dixon, how do you do? He gives the Hurricanes a one-point lead. Penn State has 27 seconds on the clock. Edgar Davis from inside his own five takes it up past the 20 to the 28 yard line. Graham Robinson throws it in and out of the hands of Matthews in the passing attack for Penn State. Is either really, really hot or really, really cold. They need to be hot right now. Muli Caliente. And that's not going to happen on that play. Well defended again. This time Davis with the bat down. Looking down field and rolls over the edge. He has an interception and now he has a sack. Fourth and 16 might be the last chance to dance. They throw the ball deep. That pass will fall incomplete. But there's a flag down. Roughing the passer. So on fourth and long they get the call that will extend the game one more play. Last chance to do something. They throw the ball deep. It's caught. But nowhere near the goal line. If they had more time, they could call a timeout. But they do not. And Miami is national champion winners again. This is their third national championship victory in four years. Again, they beat Texas A&M. Then they beat Florida. And now they beat the Nittany Lions of Penn State. 
I hope that the rest of your day is the best of your day. Peace, love. Hot sauce.